So you might be in a really weird situation where for some reason your Android calls, aka the phone calls that you keep going on and you keep trying to call people with, they keep going straight into voicemail. Now this can happen for a few different reasons, but it really depends on who you're calling and the phone number in which you're calling from. So in this case, let's say I was calling somebody random, right? Well, if they don't have any signal on their side, it doesn't matter how many times I call them, it's going to always go into voicemail. They may also have me blocked. They may also end up having just, you know, keep clicking the power button or keep canceling the call. So it goes straight into voicemail anyways. There are also some really rare examples where if I'm on a call with somebody else, the call can go straight into voicemail too. That can also happen, but that's very, very rare. Usually the person has to be denying the call, have you blocked, or they have really, really bad signal, which is usually the number one case. And that is the reason why it goes straight into voicemail. So if those are any of the reasons, those are reasons why it's probably not even going to be an issue for you. It's probably going to be an issue for the other person. Now, for some reason, that's not the big deal here. You want to take a look at your signal that you have on your phone. You want to take a very, very close look. If you have bad signal on your phone, well, that is going to be the main reason why you're having bad signal on the other things too. It's because it's just not working there. So go ahead and just double check the signal in which you have on your phone. And you want to just make sure that that is not an issue on your side. Because if it is, well, that's basically going to be the problem there too. So just make sure you have good signal on your phone, and that is probably not going to be an issue for you either. If it is, and you have bad signal, well, that's going to be the problem. But if you don't have bad signal, then you can move on to the next thing, which is making sure you're typing in the right phone number. If you're not typing in the right phone number, or if their number changed, or anything even remotely close to that, well, that is going to be another reason and another problem that you may be having too. So just make sure you're typing in the right phone number and that can probably help that situation out as well. Now, if that doesn't seem to be a problem, you may wanna see if you have an update available for your phone. So just go inside of your settings of your specific phone. You then wanna go and click on software update. And all you wanna do is go ahead and download and install the latest update that's available for your phone. For majority of people out there, that's probably all you're going to have to do. And that might end up fixing the problem if that still doesn't work. Try taking out your SIM card, reinstalling it. But those are pretty much the main ways to go and fix it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.